I'm just going to go with the exhaustive. We got 45 minutes to kill. Whoa, just in the right ear. Angry Broids. Optimistic or pessimistic? I'm more optimistic. I don't know. I don't know where to put it, but whatever. I don't have all day, except I do. Judgmental or accepting? I'm more accepting, but not that much. Like, internally, I'm kind of judgmental. I guess everyone is, but externally, it's like, why would I... I don't need to uh, to let that out. I mean, I can vent and whatnot, but like right in front of someone's face. This is a hard one. It's closer to the middle. But I'm not as realistic. Well, I do like to have like concrete things, like <laughs> serious talk while the. <laughs> Wait, I'm missing uh this one, this one. Never I like the never. There we go. <laughs> Whoa. We'll just go with that. I don't know. Goal oriented or experience oriented? I think I'm goal oriented. Well, what is experience oriented? I don't know. I'm not gonna look it up. I don't have time to look up everything. Is that an angry bird? Oh, Pikmin. Sacrilege. All right. But uh, this one's also kind of close. Because <laughs> uh, this seems like um, you don't set goals. You just kind of build skills. I don't know. I'm more goal-oriented. It's like I only learn skills to, s to achieve the goals. Or like if I want to learn a skill, I set a goal. Unambitious or driven? It depends on the day. <laughs> I don't know. Actually, unambitious, I would say, uh, is a good descriptor. Because even when I'm motivated, not ambitious, I'm just like chilling, having fun. So yeah, this one's this one's pretty far there because driven. It's just like if you're like success driven or whatever. I don't know. I just want to chill out. Fulfilled or unfulfilled. Depends on the day. <laughs> Common phrase uttered. Well, we'll just go with today. I'm good. I'm I'm feeling good today. But sure, I don't know. Original or cliche? <laughs> oh man. See, that's the thing, it's like, I was thinking about this earlier, I like a good, uh, even if I, it's been said a billion times, I like a good meme, I don't know, it's kind of cringe. Uh, either way, I don't really think I'm that original, but I, I don't know. I've got an original blend of cliches. <laughs> Does that count? Photographer or physicist? This is like neither one. <laughs> I'm more of a physicist, but then at the same time, I'm more of a uh, like photographer. No, like actual like that. An actual physicist? No. But I'm adjacent to both, but the same distance. I'm gonna run out of time. I'll I'll go this way because I don't I don't know. 
forward or repress? What is forward? Is this in a social situation or what? I don't know. Oh, forward, like forward thinking? Forward, I don't know. Like imposing forward? I don't know, sure. I don't, I don't know. Activist or nonpartisan? I mean, I don't know. Eventually, I want to take actions that uh, help people out. <laughs> I used to. Um, but right now, right now I'm on my nonpartisan arc, I guess. I don't know. It'll change later. Gluttonous or moderate? Uh, I'd say I'm a little gluttonous. Orderly or chaotic? I mean, it's an organized chaos. I don't know. Like, I, I have a place for everything. I recently organized my house, so a little bit orderly. I got new hangers that are like all the same <laughs> there that gives me a lot of points right um my main room out there is completely clear my bins are in the closet um yeah that makes sense friendly or unfriendly very friendly but uh to my own detriment <laughs> i took a, a big five and i scored high on agreeableness Fat lot of good that's done me. <laughs> that's fine. Hugs or handshakes? That's weird. I do both. And I don't know what determines it. I go hugs. Focused or absent minded? Right now I'm absent minded a bit because I hit that go live and my brain empties, but. Whoa. Um, uh, it's hard to say. Yeah, I would say absent-minded, because it's like, not like you don't ever get anything done. It's just like eventually you'll you might get around to it, and yeah. Uh, <laughs> I don't have a. I mean, when I was a kid, I grew carrots in the garden, and they were like this big. It was like baby carrots. They were so bad that I put them in the the fair. I entered them into the county fair. And there was no other carrots competing, and I got second place. So I lost to nobody. So, yeah. Calm or anxious? I'm not that anxious, but I am anxious. Mind's own business, snoops. We do a little bit of snooping. No, I don't really snoop uh, on things that aren't like um, public like I'll if uh, someone has like a link to a personal website they made I'll be like ooh let's check that out but they're putting that out there or like I'll go down the internet rabbit hole but that's not snooping because it's all like put out there I wouldn't go out of my way to try, like, try and find stuff that people didn't want yeah. I'll put a little bit just because I, I would like to know, but I don't do it without permission, so. <laughs> <laughs> the holy hee hee. Thinker feeler. Actually, I'm pretty split on this one on the Myers Briggs, I know that. But I have like a little bit more. Uh, like I'm an INFP, so a little bit more feeler. Why was he in just the right ear? What what was it? Just a random Oh, this one. <laughs> Alright. Good manners, bad manners. I say good manners. I don't have any opposition to like for instance for example, I don't have any opposition to like cursing, but I just don't do it. It's just not a habit. Um well I guess I do kind of now. I don't know. I've been a little more, but like, 
it's just like it's always it just has like a, a filter and then I like say do I want to say this and then I whatever for curse words just I don't know like I don't really care if I didn't have that I would be fine but I, it just left over I guess oh you can skip a question stable or unstable I'm very unstable <laughs> I don't know yeah cause I, I Depends on the day. <laughs> uh oh. Bot alert. If you're not a bot, say something human right now. You have five seconds. Get banned. get cleared out. Alright. Assertive or passive? I'm pretty passive. Although I'm less like bothered or less like obsessed with being passive, <laughs> if that makes sense. Recently I actually uh wait, why is Twitch uh chat not working? Whatever. Combined chat's working, so that's fine. Recently, I, I uh, went to the store and got like a refund. Wait, it's in the the tags, right? Costco executive member went to Costco. I bought something. It went on sale later, and then I would, uh, went back and got a uh, a refund for the difference. And they didn't want to give it to me because it had been too long. But I could have just returned it. So I was like, Are you gonna make me just return it and buy a new one and whatever? So it was kind of like mini Karen mode cringe anyway it's fine outdoorsy or indoorsy so this is a strange one I was in Boy Scouts um what okay cringe <laughs> um but I haven't gone camping in years but like I could I could do it easily actually do I have the equipment I don't know, but I know what equipment I need. I could uh, stop by a... Well, it has tarps <laughs> and tents. I guess I have to get a uh, tarp somewhere. Hardware store. I don't know. I could stop by the store and then I'd be fine surviving out there. But since I haven't been camping in a while, I'll go like this. Entrepreneur or employee? So this is strange. One. I guess employee because I'm not doing any outside stuff, but kind of want, maybe want to. That's close enough. Uh, okay. um, I might want to sell some of these things. Is that, is that the right link? Yeah. Might want to make a bunch of these and sell them. I've been just like giving him his gift. Jeez, my internet's slow because I'm uploading a. Well, why would that matter? <laughs> anyway. Oh, my desktop audio has been muted this entire time. You haven't been hearing all this. Cringe. See, so witness the, uh, the awesomeness. <laughs> Let's just fall. Four points. Um, so I might want to sell something like that, but like, it would be so annoying to have to run a business. So. Popular or rejected? I don't think this is really relevant anymore. <laughs> like, I'm just kind of whatever. Um, I guess I could skip it. Nah, it's, I'd say... It was never popular, but it was never really rejected either. Sure. Noble or jovial? What is noble? Or how is that the opposite of jovial? I'm overthinking these. I'm gonna have to speed up. 
I'm jovial. I don't know if I'm no boy or not, but I'm jovial. Prankster or anti-prank? Is this a thing? I like to joke, but I don't know if I like to prank. I'm not anti-prank. these sounds we're gonna close that one it's just like Bang. i don't know any of these sounds competitive or cooperative i'm not very competitive social or reclusive let's be honest <laughs> like i don't like going out <laughs> whoa that was a lot of them trusting or suspicious for better or worse i'm very trusting manic or mild I don't know. Hesitant. <laughs> That's the only one I'll be decisive on is that I'm hesitant. All seeing or blind? I'm just a guy. <laughs> I'm just a normal person. What does this mean? I'm normal. Militaristic hippie? I don't know. Yeah, I'm probably... Love shy or Casanova? I'm a bit shy. Chronically single. <laughs> I mean, I have never dated anyone, so I have to put 100%. Oof. That's fine. Imaginative or practical? I'd say imaginative. Goofy or unfrivolous? Unfunny. Anyway. Stuck in the past or forward thinking. So that's the problem. I guess it's not the past if it's been preserved into the present. Because I'm just thinking I hold on to all this old stuff that I've either made or done or whatever. Um, but only if it still exists in the present. So we'll go like that. Dystopian or utopian? What does that mean? I'm not the earth. <laughs> Um, do I think the earth is dystopian? Yes. Chatty or reserved? I really got to go out of my way to become chatty. Whatever I am. Main character, side character. Definitely side character energy. I am very reactive. It's hard to just like do something without someone like saying something or whatever. Like it's just left on my own. I just don't do anything. Well, I don't do nothing. Shy or bold? Yeet. Handy or can't fix anything? More like don't want to fix anything. <laughs> but I fixed a laptop recently, so that's got to count for something. But I don't do um, stuff around the house. Self-conscious or self-assured? Definitely. Eager or reluctant? Depends on the th Yeah, reluctant. But not that reluctant. Flawed or perfect? I mean, who would put perfect on this? Doesn't make any sense. Thick skinned or sensitive? I would get less sensitive. Although I did get uncomfortable from something someone didn't even say that I was making up in my head. So, <laughs> recently. So, you know. Junkie or straight edge? I've never done. I've never eaten a drug, but I I would maybe try it, so I'll leave room there. Harsh or gentle? Can I ever be? I don't know. I'm not really harsh at all. Okay. <coughs> Whoa, that was a good one. Fake or real? I don't know. Obedient or rebellious? <laughs> Depends on the context. I don't know. Uh, something like that. Disorganized or self-disciplined? I'm not really self-disciplined, but I'm not disorganized. Angry birds. Persistent or quitter? Problem is I quit and then I go back to it. So I would go like a little bit quitter. Lion or zebra? <laughs> what does that mean? 
Should I just skip this one? A lion. Like courage and all that. Zebra. Zebraness. I don't understand it. Secret ever open book. I would say open book, but not always. So it's like a little bit open book. There we go. People person or things person. <laughs> that seems like uh that seems like me a things person. It's a good way to put it. Spirited or lifeless? I don't know. I'm alive. I eat, therefore I am. Put that in your pipe and smoke it, Descartes. Feed thyself. I forget who said no thyself. But uh, take that one and call me in the morning. All right. Inappropriate or seemly? All right, I'm going to look up that one. I have no idea what it means. Conforming to standards. Okay. I don't know. Perceptive or unobservant? I was in a restaurant a month ago or so, and there was this giant chandelier thingy, and I didn't even notice it. And someone was like, oh, look at that. Um, and I was like, we've been here for 30 minutes. I didn't even see that. But I observe things maybe not in the like space around me, but I don't know. Uh, yeah, not observant. Not a lawyer. I hate. Well, that's a little bit because I I do know a little bit about like code licensing. Forgiving or vengeful. Ah, uh, I don't see the point in revenge really. Like, it's just like, I don't know. It's not going to solve anything. I guess there's a thing to be said for, like, justice, which is meant to like, try and have it solve as much as you can and then prevent it from happening again type thing. <laughs> Thinker or doer? I'm more of a sleeper. <laughs> Or sleeper on this one. Uh, do, 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 do. Quivering or unstirring? I'm literally like tapping my foot right now. <laughs> Sincere or irreverent? I don't know. Both. But yeah, 69. Hates PDA. Oh, public displays of affection. I don't really care. I don't do it, but I don't hate it. I don't hate it, so I'll just leave it there. It doesn't really bother me. Unless I'm like, uh, someone else next to me is being, sees it and is bothered, then it kind of bothers me. I don't know why, but it's fine. Pointless or meaningful? Um, both. I think actually both. Smug or sheepish? Aren't those the same thing? I'm more zebra-ish, you know? Embarrassed. Oh, smug is like, not embarrassed, you're like, owning it. Sheep is like. Patient or impatient? I think I'm patient. Patient in the long term, but not in the short term. Focused on the present, focused on the future. Unfortunately, I focus way too much on the future. But not always. Like, sometimes I get in the groove of something. <laughs> it's good times. Extrovert or introvert? I do need a little bit of people time, but mostly myself. Impulsive or cautious? Very cautious. I'd be impulsive when it doesn't take any risk, but that's, like, not what this is asking. Stereotypical or boundary breaking? Eh, a little bit. Creator or consumer? Right now, I'm creating. Well, I'm both creating and consuming. <laughs> <laughs> yes, high quality consumption and high quality output. Um, 
Oh, I should use dark mode. <laughs> Sorry about that. There we go. Um, in general, I consume more than I create. Well, as far as like some aspects. But right now, I get to say, <laughs> also because in the future, I don't like if this continues, you know. We'll say like that. Goes through different changes. Parental or childlike? I don't think I've ever been parental. Like, in a friend group, sometimes people will have, like, the mom or whatever. Or the dad or whatever. It's like, I don't think I've ever been that in a friend group. But I'm not, like, super childlike. Accurate or off target? I always said, some people say I never miss. I say I always miss, but never by much. <laughs> I don't know. I was just like... True. We're just going to take this to mean like accurate slash precise, like whatever. Um, Angibroids. Um, I do like to get specific and accurate sometimes. Questioning or believing? That is a hard question. I think I'm questioning, but like doesn't stop me from believing. Open or guarded? <laughs> Pretty open. Blue or red? Hmm. I'm wearing white and black. <laughs> this is actually gray. It looks kind of green on screen. Blue or red? My stuff is like not either one. <laughs> we don't got all day. A little red. I don't know. Annoying or unannoying? So that's the thing, is I always think I'm being annoying, but I never am. People are like, no, you're not being annoying. The only time I'm being annoying is when I constantly ask, am I being annoying? So I would say unannoying, but that I think I'm annoying, or like it feels like it, even though I know I'm not. Writer or reader? Neither. <laughs> I mean, I guess I write some stuff on my blog, and I haven't read stuff in a little while. But I don't write. I do read a, a book like every few months or something. <laughs> Bear or wolf? I thought there's just wolf and wolf. Inside you, there are two wolves. See, I didn't get the lion zebra one. I don't understand the bear wolf one either, so I'm going to skip it. Resentful or euphoric? Resentful or euphoric? Oh, okay, so, like, do you hold on to resentment, or you just, like, live in a utopia? Uh, resentment can kind of get in the way of relationships until it's cleared up for me. Playful or serious? See, that's the thing. I feel like I'm high on both of these. Like, right now, I'm being kind of serious. Because um, I don't know how to be playful right now, but when I'm, like, goofing around... Then I, and I guess I kind of was earlier. I don't know. I would say more serious because when I'm serious, I don't know how to be. No, but when I get into a goofy mood, I don't know how to be serious. So this is a dead even. Oh, I hit the 50-50. Like, no, uh, not just being lazy and not wanting to answer. It's a dead even. Overthinker or underthinker? Whoa. The underthinker. Evolutionist or creationist? I mean, uh, I'd say evolutionist. But that's like the processes we're set up or the laws of physics. Idealist or realist? Definitely an idealist. I have like always a mental list of things I'm waiting for. I actually wrote it down, but um, usually it's just a mental list. <coughs> Actually, writing it down kind of helped to stop thinking about it, but still think about it sometimes. Uh, not like a bucket list, but like a, I need to have my life together, boring logistics stuff that I don't want to do type thing. Or things that I do want to do but aren't possible um, with like huh? technology of like being free from different tech companies and whatnot. Awkward or comfortable. 
I tend to just like drift into awkwardness and then not know how to just relax in social situations. Quiet or loud? I'm pretty quiet. I would say old fashioned or progressive. Definitely progressive with the caveat that like if you want to be old fashioned as long as it's not hurting anybody, it's fine. In some t in some areas I do want to uh, and some I don't, but I think that's what progressive is, is having the option. Even if you, well, this is just kind of in, like, once you have, maybe it's not asking, but it's once you do have the option, then, like, which one do you choose? And so that it goes a little bit that way. Likes change or resist change? So that is the funny thing. I do resist change just because it takes up time to... <laughs> To like readjust everything, but if something changed, Angry Birds, if something changed and I didn't really use it, like if I, for example, if my car broke or something, I had to get a new car, that's all a big change. Uh, even if I got the money back, the insurance, I would really not want to go through that kind of change. Angry Bird, and because it's a lot of like work, um, or like I have to move if that's a big change. Uh, that requires a lot of moving stuff and like paperwork but then when it's something changes uh, that is not doesn't require a lot of work it just requires different like uh, I don't know stuff it sometimes comes naturally and I do like change even if it is hard It's hard to say. I was going to be over here, but I think I'm over here. Because I like the output, the effect of change. And it's worth it. And, like, I did move. Uh, and I'm glad I did. Caddy or supportive. Yeah, I don't, like, do... Uh, take shots and jabs at people, so I don't know. Even though it would be kind of fun, I just... That's not my humor style. Well, it kind of I do sometimes, but only after like a long time is built up, and I, I don't like default to that. Slumping or insomniac, both. <laughs> like right now, I'm not tired, and I want to be tired, but then later I'll be like, I guess that's insomniac. Then I sleep for like ten hours. The spaghetti. Night owl. Ah. Scheduled or spontaneous? I have a schedule, but then the stuff that's not like a very, like anything, if there's an event that I need to be at a certain time, I'll put it on the calendar. But 90% of the time, it's like, who knows? Yeah, I don't have that much energy. Innovative or routine? See, that's the thing. Once I come up with something or figure something out, I don't like to, like, do the daily, put in the daily work. I'd rather come up with the next new thing and not even enjoy the <laughs> old thing. Or, like, not even just repeat the old thing. Divine or earthly? I guess both. Yeah, I'd say 50-50. Maverick or conformist? What is a maverick? Oh, it's like the the bull, right? That's like oh uppity or whatever. I don't know. Honestly, I'm very conformist <laughs> in the sense that like the things that matter to I don't know people in power. I'm not challenging that. Maybe I should be. want to but chill or sassy yeah that's fine mechanical or natural I guess mechanical I don't know <laughs> social chameleon strong identity I used to be like way over here or here and now I'm more like here and it's going the other way and I trying to <laughs> push it down there Maybe like that. It's going this way, but it's not. 
I mean, it's gone further. It's it has gone further because I'm like not blending in in a few places, or like blending in less in in most places, blending in way even less. And yeah, it's gone further than I thought. Independent or codependent? I don't know. I'd like to be more codependent, but I'm independent. Social climber? What is a social climber? Nonconformist? Is that someone who's like trying to get clout or something? I don't know. Leader or follower? I'd say I'm a good follower rather than a good leader. Outgoing or withdrawn? Definitely more withdrawn. Disturbing or enchanting? I don't know. What does enchanting mean? Like, I'm gonna cast a spell on you? I'm not disturbing. Like, no one's. Meets me and is like, ugh. <laughs> yeah, exactly. No one does that when they see, they see me, so. <laughs> Naughty or nice? I don't know, I guess the dice. I didn't get coal this year, or last year. Confident or insecure. Yeah, it's getting better, but it's moving this way. Insightful or generic? Uh, I hate to pat myself on the back, but whatever. Grounded or fantasy prone? Uh, I do stay kind of grounded. See, all these are like both. Homebody or world traveler? This one is... I have not left the country. <laughs> Capitalist or communist? I don't know. See, it's like, I kind of have no choice because I'm in a capitalist economy. But I guess they're saying if you did have a choice. I don't know. I haven't really like done my research, so I don't know. I guess I could skip the question. Because the thing is, like, I've seen the bad of both. So it's like, why would it? <laughs> I don't know. Why can't we come up with something else? I guess it's just, like, a hard problem. Yeah, I don't know. I haven't done enough research. Tired or wired? Let's go. That's a good question. Usually tired. Right now, I'm, like, almost tired and, like, but I'm fine. Guess big vocabulary. Many word do trick. Positive or negative? I do focus on the negative in my like thinking or like my evaluation of things, as you could probably tell from this whole ordeal. But as far as the things that I like. I don't know, do I focus on the positive? And I enjoy the outcome. I'm not like negative all the time in front of other people. It's only when I'm talking about myself. Like I'm positive about it. Positive ish and like neutral about external things. And then like negative or neutral about myself. But I feel like I'm also sometimes positive about myself, so it kind of evens out a little positive. Clinical or heartfelt? I don't know. Glamorous or Spartan? I mean, <laughs> this is not very either one. Oh. Oh. It's kind of like whatever. Not like glamorous, but it's a little, it's less Spartan. Oh, more goose. It's less Spartan, so we'll do that. Intuitive or analytical? This is a hard question. It's like I'm intuitive, and then if I can get my brain to stop being lazy, I'm analytical. So I rely on my intuition until like. I can kick my brain into 
starting up and then actually think. <laughs> and then in that case, I have like a whole bunch of stuff that'll like help me and sort through everything. But it's mostly sorting through with intuition, to be fair, even when I'm, my brain is active, so. Yeah, I don't have like rigorous proofs and stuff. <laughs> Blessed or cursed? <laughs> Blurst. I mean, hashtag blurst. No, I don't think I'm like cursed. <laughs> I guess like, sure, I don't know. I don't really understand it. Ambitious or realistic? I'm not very ambitious. I'm not like, I'm gonna do this and then start a company and uh, build this whole whatever, but I guess I have a little bit of, well, I'm just like, oh, this is possible, let me do that, and then build on it, and figure out what I can do, but like, yeah, I don't know, we already did this one, proud or apologetic, <laughs> I always am like, oh, I'm sorry, and then I'm like, no, I'm not sorry, I didn't, I'm just saying that, buffoon, I was gonna put that in my title, but I picked bozo instead, Dang, I should've. <laughs> buffoon. 100% buffoon. No, I don't think it's actually 100%. Wait, 77. Woke or problematic? <laughs> Why do they have to, these are just cringe terms. Whatever. You have merely adopted the wokeness. I was born in it, molded by it. There we go. Spontaneous or deliberate. See, that's the weird thing. Is like, I'm not a risk taker, but I am spontaneous, I think. But then again, I do kind of like plan things in my head beforehand, at least when it comes to conversations. But like, no, I'm more spontaneous. Like, I wasn't even planning to do this today. I just had like what? it on my to-do list and I had I was like, oh, I want to stream. So I went live, and then I'm like, what should I do? I check my list. So I know I'm spontaneous, and so then I put things on the list for me to find when I need them, which is the deliberate part, but not as, but it's kind of a compensation. Okay, we got five minutes. Bubbly or flat? Eh, a little bubbly, I guess. Lumberjack, mad scientist. I'm a lumberjack, and I'm okay. I'm definitely a mad scientist. Uh, that is a good description. Grumpy or cheery? <laughs> Humbug. I'm oh, just kidding. Hopeful or fearful? What was it I've... S I don't know. Sometimes I just... It's a recent thing that started happening of like... Uh, just like a bit of like existential, uh, I don't know what to call it, just the fear that, uh, that I have more choice than I thought, more options, um, and like on certain things there's no one telling me what to do and so then that like terrifies me, but I would say that's le that's the exception to the rule. I'm excited by the possibilities. Jeez. I'm just only like afraid of like closing off other options. Um, sloppy or fussy? What is fussy? I don't know. Like, I don't know. Gross or hygienic? I think I'm fine. Cringing away. Welcoming experience. <laughs> I think I cringe a little bit, but then I get over it. Kangaroo or dolphin? Again, with these animal questions. A kangaroo, they're like chunky boyos. A dolphin, they're like smooth dudes, but also kind of mean. Both of them are kind of mean. I'm gonna skip the question. Sweet or savory? I like savory foods. But am 
my savory. I don't know. You are what you eat. I'll go with that. Uptight or easy. Emotional or logical. It's weird because thinking and feeling, I'm a little more feeling. But emotional or logical, I'm a little more logical. <laughs> I feel like. <laughs> what does that mean? <laughs> that doesn't make any sense. Um, <laughs> I don't know. It feels right. <laughs> I'm logical in my emotions. I have a framework for it. Delicate or coarse? I don't know. Last one. Prying or unmeddlesome? This is perfect timing. Oh, not for those. Prying or unmeddlesome? Yeah, I don't know. All right, who am I? You have completed the list. Do optional survey. <sighs> no, I don't know enough characters, and also like I just I, the time ended. So <coughs> sorry. I guess I could probably could say I don't know if I don't know. Loading. I have not seen Game of Thrones. Okay, they've got other ones. Hey, I'm the Ratatouille guy. Let's go. What's this? It's tied. So I don't know Game of Thrones, so it's not going to be helpful. But Alfredo Linguini, is that the main character? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's me. I don't know any of these people. Who is this from Beauty and the Beast? Oh, maybe I've seen, I've seen clips of Silicon Valley. I don't know who this guy is. I don't know who that guy is. <laughs> Maybe that's the problem. I just don't know enough uh, characters. Move on. I read this book. I didn't see the movie. Is he the main character? I feel like they went and ran with that main character thing. Well, maybe not. Oh, this is not the main character. Oh, this is that other dude in the army. Is he holding a bean? Uh, let me just see who that is in the movie. In the because I read the book, but I, it was a long time ago. Yeah, yeah. Jeez. Okay, I have not seen any of this. I've just seen Stranger Things. I want to see Star Trek DS9. I haven't seen Ghostbusters except the cartoon one time and I don't remember any of it. The Simpsons. I've seen like one episode some time. I know this guy looks like but I don't know. Where was I? There I am. Parks and Rec. I don't know who that is in Parks and Rec. I've only seen a little bit. Oh, Little Women. I've read that. Who is Beth again? <laughs> I don't remember. Monty's. Bob's Burgers. I think someone compared me to Tina from Bob's Burgers before. That's really interesting. But I haven't seen it. What am I supposed to do? Waste years of my life? Wait, the Flash. Oh, Cisco. I remember Cisco. Yeah. They literally named him after a router. Crazy. I'm the flounder for the little mermaid. Seventy percent. We're getting down into the low. What's up, guys? It's Quandale Dingle here. <laughs> I have been arrested for multiple crimes, <laughs> including. Battery on a police officer, what? grand theft, declaring war on Italy, and public declaring indecency. I Italy. will be escaping prison on March 28th. After that, I will take over the world. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna go. Bruce Banner. <laughs> Ted Lasso. I've not seen it, but. I know people have seen it. Tin Man and the Cowardly Lion. That doesn't make any sense. 
How can I be both 68% of both? And how am I Morty? I put mad scientists and they're like, you're Morty. This is, uh... I'm not Morty, alright. I'll have you know. How am I Luna Lovegood and Dobby? You know what? Screw Harry Potter. We don't need those. Pride and Prejudice. I don't remember who this is, but I've read the book. See, that's the problem. Uh, my memory's so bad. Friar Tuck from Robin Hood. Oh, I've seen the news. Is that the... What is happening? The Incredibles. Let's go. Finally. Penny from Dr. Horrible. <laughs> this is funny. <laughs> See, I put main character mad scientist and now they're like, you're Morty and Frodo. It's like, no I'm not. Doesn't make any sense. And I'm also the Scarecrow. I am the uh, Tin Man, Cowardly Lion, and the Scarecrow. And I'm Grandpa Joe from, from Willy Wonka. <laughs> yeah, I remember this guy. Oh, man. And I'm Gabriella from High School Musical. We're getting into 65. I'll go down to 60 and I'll stop. <laughs> the Pope? Is that the actual Pope? Or a person named Pope? Okay. Person named Pope. It would have said, from real life. <laughs> but this is fictional characters. Alright, I'll stop at 60. Alright, we're going all out for the end of the hour. There we are. <laughs> I'm Professor Oak. Sixty percent, sixty-one percent. Yeah, we're getting into repeat franchises, so it's like it's yeah, it's whatever. Linguini. I, I don't remember what this guy was like, or this guy, despite having seen him. And I don't remember which person Beth was. Yeah, high tech. <laughs> it's just like the literal uh, hacker bands. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I've seen like one episode, I think. Tin Man and Lion. And Morty. Oh, wait. <laughs> I got it confused. I thought it was telling me I was Rick because I put Mad Scientist. Morty is not a Mad Scientist. Yeah, he's not. So I don't know what they're on about. And I don't remember who that is. I'm not going to keep these, so I'm closing some of them. Whatever. Anyway. Wow. Crazy. <laughs> I think I'm going to try and sleep. I'll take some more tests next time. I have some more lined up.